Hello and welcome. This is Mel Skinner, and I'm back with Leo, and we're doing some more of We Were Here Too, and we're moving into a new room. Okay, so I have another one of these switches. I'm going to go ahead and pull that. I don't know if it does anything. Okay. Uh, the door just slammed shut behind me. I have pools of lava. I have what looks like a, a ship's... Uh, what do they call that? The wheel. I think it's also called the tiller, right? And I have two pathways. Looks like I'm in an armory. Uh, I have a bunch of weapons. It looks like I can interact with them. But there's a lot of weapons. I don't know if I should touch them just yet. All right, I think... Ah, oh, crap. All right, we need to uh, combine suits of armor with weapons, I think. Yes, I, that's what I see too. Uh, I also have a symbol over top the armor. I don't know if it, oh, the wheel's turning. Is that relevant to you? Yes, because the room for me is getting smaller. Um, All right, so I've oh. got a couple of... Uh, yeah, thank you. Okay, that, I, that presents that, but... All right. Okay, I'll let you talk, and I'll hold the wall. All right, so we have one suit of armor that has the uh, eagle banner okay. on top of it that has a curved axe. Curved axe, okay. Uh, I'm going to let go of the wall and just find the suit of armor they need to go to right. real quick. So, uh, okay, I think I found the eagle, and now I'm going to reset the wall. When I when I hit this, does it reset the wall or does it just stop it? It uh, it, it resets the wall as long as you okay. hold it. It, it, it set it all the way to the beginning? Yeah, yeah. Okay, good. Uh, so you, um, you, you can save me until the last moment, but you do need to find the uh, the curved X. Oh, is it going back now? Yeah, yeah. You, you can't keep okay. holding it. Just keep go search for the X. Okay, you, so you there have... are many different axes. So can you describe it to me a little bit more? Uh, it's... Um, it's got a very... Uh, long point towards the top of the axe. Uh huh. Um, and it's got uh, two bits at uh, from the from, on the back of the on the top of the head of the axe. I'm not I'm not sure I'm able to describe this properly. Well, uh, unfortunately, I have four different axes, so uh, all the fine details are going to be important. So you said there's a point on the top. I think there's only one that fits that description, though. Um, how do I pick it up? Okay, uh, and that goes to the eagle. Is there a particular hand it goes in? Uh, it should be the right hand. And, okay. Uh, if it's right, it should light up. Uh, it didn't. Oh. I know of. Let me, uh, let me look at that again. Okay, so the axe I, I have had a, a point off of the um, the handle, and it's only one-sided. Like, it's not like a, a battle axe with two... All right, it, it is a one-sided axe. Okay. Um, maybe I put it in the wrong hand. Uh, okay, well, so that, that one doesn't work, so I'm going to go ahead and put it back. Yeah, all, all, all the knights here have shields except for one, I think. So maybe you need to also have a shield on them. Oh, does that one have a shield? Yes. I don't know how to. I don't. I don't know how to drop them. Oh, okay. There we go. Oh, okay. So maybe that was the right axe. It just uh, didn't have a shield. Okay. So I guess we also need to find the shield. It's a round shield with a metal bit in the middle, of made of okay. wood. I haven't it? found a shield yet, but uh, I'll look around. Shield, metal bit in the middle. Okay. Oh, I see the I see the shields. I think I think you see the one you're talking about. Does it have uh, four other circles on it? Yes. Okay, that's it. Um, it didn't light up. All right, well, it could be that I have the wrong axe. Um, let me describe the axes a little bit more, and we'll see if we can find the right one. And it's possible I have the wrong one. So the one I was describing had the spike on the the top of the the middle part, the the, the handle right. that you hold on. Yeah, to. no, that, that, that's not right. The, the blades 
has has a point in it that curves uh, back towards itself a bit. Oh, okay, top. I think I know which one you're talking about now. Um, so it, yeah, okay. I think I know which one that is. Uh, let me describe it more, just so we're certain. So, does it have on the uh, the opposite side? Does it have two little um, blades that that are yes. kind of separate from each other? Okay, that sounds like that. The one thing I haven't figured out is, uh, okay, I, I'm gonna have to go get that one again because I think I have to drop the one that's there first. Okay, yeah. If you're about to die, let me know. I'll scream. I'm gonna, I'm gonna re. Yeah, I'll reset uh, the wheel every time I go past it, but. Uh... That's all right. I'm, I'm not currently in any real danger yet. Okay. We just can't give in to indecision. We have to make a mind. Okay, well, I think this one is uh, probably the right one. Okay, that time it made a sound. I can't tell if it... Okay, it did die that. Yeah. Okay, so that's one. Uh, let's do another one then. All right, reset it. All right, I will. I'll hold it so you can get a good look. All right. From the crest of a... I think it's sort of like a black line with a white mane. It has a crown on top of it. Okay. Yeah, that's just a knight with only a kite shield on the left hand. The kite shield is uh, has a is a yeah, I know iron a encircled. Okay. Does it um have a notch on the top? Uh, yeah, it has notches on the top and the both sides. Both sides. Yeah, it looks like this one. Double check because there's another shield that looks similar. It has also got this metal circle in the middle. Just one, though, right? Yes, yeah, just one. Uh, okay, that's for sure the right one. And that's in the lion. Okay. Left hand. That did make a growl noise at me. I don't know if it uh, lit up. I, I didn't stick around to look. Uh, yes, it's correct. Okay, was there anything else? Uh, there's two more knights to go. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, one is a, uh, a badger with a piece of paper in his hand. Okay. With a crown on it. Okay. That has a knight with a long straight blade in his okay. left hand. Does he have any shields? No shields. Okay, long straight blade. And it's a sword. Okay. Yes. Okay, so when you say straight, you mean just one uh, single-edged? Uh, Double-edged. Double edged, okay. And does it have a notch in it? Uh, no notches. Okay, that's not that one. Um, it's uh, it's it symmetrical. It is symmetrical. Does it have a, a bit in the kind of lower middle that is, uh, what is the shape? More like a hexagon? And then, like, are there any protrusions at all in the blade? Uh, uh, it's, it's got. And minor uh, thickening at the at the bottom a bit, but nothing. Most of it is just a straight blade. Okay, gotcha. I think I may see the one that you're talking about, but I I just am trying to be thorough because uh, the blades have very subtle. Diff well, I say subtle, but describing them, it's going to be subtle. Yeah, yeah. Um. So I saw the one blade. Uh, it looked like it was just flying in the air, but I don't know. Huh. All right, I'll just move on. Let's look at the other side, because I don't think I've seen the one you're talking about yet. Because there's two uh, sides to the room that I have to check each side. Mm -hmm. So you said there's a widening at the base? A little bit, yes. Okay, I think I see the one you're talking about. This... Oh. Uh oh Yeah, it doesn't really have any features otherwise. <laughs> okay, the game just kind of bugged out on me. Uh, the sword I want is not uh, behaving itself. Let's oh. try this one. You said it's in the right hand? Uh, left hand. That's right, correct. Alright, and one last one that... I can't quite tell what the creature is. Oh, well, it's the last one, so I know which All right, one. Alright, well, uh, he's got a sort of a round shield with notches in all four uh, cardinal directions. Okay, and he is uh, holding a single-edged blade 
that um, has um, uh, notches on the back and it uh, it's th uh, th well it curves on at the top of part of the blade. Okay, notches on the one side but not the other. Yeah, on, on the non-cutting side it has notches. Okay, I'll go look. The shield goes on the, the right hand. Right hand, okay, I'm gonna have to flip that. Um, how many notches are there? It has... Uh, damn. I'm gonna see. do the wall in a second. One, two, three, four notches. Four notches, okay, I think I may have found the one you're talking about. But I have to f I have to search the shield first. Okay. Uh, if it's not right, then you know it's not probably that big of a deal. But not yet, no. So, is there a curve uh, like the 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 edge, the side with the edge? Is there like um, a more prominent top? Uh, yes, a much more prominent top. Okay, gotcha. That's All it. Right, that did it. Checkpoint reached. Okay. Right. Uh, locked door in. locked behind me. Um, there's a grid in front of me. Uh, it looks like it's metal and wood. I'm not going to step on it just yet because it might be uh, trapped. Uh, hmm. I have windows that I can interact with. They look like stained glass and they have images on them. I also have stained glass windows. Okay. Uh... They look like uh, people that are dying with sinister faces above them. Okay, let me see what they look like. I didn't look at them too closely. Um, yeah, that that ag agrees with what I see. So I also right. have a lever on my side that I can't pull. A lever, okay. Yeah, a red lever. Um, Go ahead and pull it. I can't. It uh, it okay. won't interact. Okay. So whatever it is. I'm not sure it what is. this grid in the middle is yet. I'm gonna step on it and see what happens. Right. Uh, as far as I can tell, nothing happened. Okay. So I don't know what that is for just yet. Do you want me to start interacting with the stained glass windows? Well, uh, I guess. Can you interact with yours on your side? Because I can't on mine. Seems I can interact with them. I am just not sure in which order we should do them. All right. Well, maybe we need to match them. So. No, I, I can't. I can only look at mine. So maybe you can match them. Okay. So I have six. How many do you have? I have three windows. Okay. So I think we have to figure out which ones are the right ones. So I have a. I'll start with the first one here. Um. I have the sinister looking face at the top looks like a uh, he has a king's crown and it looks like he's wearing a suit of armor and then he's got a like um, pearl necklace with a metal on it. Does that seem like any of the guys on your side? Uh, could be one of my guys. Okay. Is, he above, got a... is, he, is he above a maiden with a dagger in her hand that has blood on it with yellow, with no, yellow hair? No, but I have that maiden. Um, the maiden I have with the dagger with the blood is above a guy with a very big bushy beard. And his helmet is uh, kind of got an animal's face on it. Like the visor. Does that look sound familiar? Uh, I do have that guy, but he is above an, uh, someone who has wearing armor killed by arrows. Okay, so so far, what I I'm seeing the the people you're describing like uh, I have a guy that looks like a knight with arrows that have killed him, but above him is that 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 king guy that I told you about with the with the pearl necklace. So I'm gonna look at the other side, see if we find anything that's more similar to what you're saying. Go ahead and describe the uh, the third one, the one we ha you we haven't talked about yet. Oh, well, on my side, William. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
All right, it's a sinister looking guy with full beard and mustache in what looks like armor with a lion head helmet above uh -huh. a red haired woman with a dagger as well. Oh, okay. Uh, huh. Okay, well, I don't think my mind match yours very well. So I'm gonna see what we can do here by interacting. So. Maybe I'm only interacting with part of the stained glass rather than the whole thing. I'm not really sure because they, they none of the guys uh, Shut are up matching. For a moment. Oh, something just happened and I I missed it completely. Uh oh. Oh. Ah, okay. I have more on my side than I first realized. I'm gonna look around to see if there's anything else I'm missing. Okay, uh, I have a book. I haven't read it yet, though. Let me let me see what it says. Okay, it looks like a ledger. It's very hard for me to make out. There are dates on it. I cannot read them very easily. Um, there's okay. The ledger has date. Well, actually, it has number, and there the numbers go up to twenty, but then it wraps over to the next page, and then it starts over from one. Uh, okay. The next column after number is date, then name, then I can't make out what the word is. Spouse, I think it says. And then the last thing I think says fortune. So. Yep. Some of them, for the spouse, it just says yes or no. The fortune one, I, oh, who knows. Um, some of them say Prince. I can make that much out. And then, okay, just to say real quickly, they're on the book itself, splattered in red. It says, what have I done? I don't know what any of this means. <laughs> it could just be story. I don't know if it's relevant to the... Maybe, but... I don't see anything that's particularly relevant here. I did find a switch that I could throw. Uh -huh. Not sure if that did anything, though. Um, let me check. Not that I'm aware of. Um, is it is it already thrown? I, I threw it already, yes. Uh, can you flip it back? No. Okay. It's non-interactable now. There's one thing I haven't tried. Let me let me see if I uh, had an interaction over here. I just assumed that this was the way out, but uh, huh. Hmm. Okay, I haven't quite figured out what it is that we uh, need to do yet. Yeah, neither. Well, I, I can try interacting with the stained glass and just see what happens. That's the only suggestion I have. Unless you have something else you can do. Uh, no, I can only look at the stained glass. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and click. You said there was a guy that was pierced with arrows. What does his face look like? Is it covered or is it open? It's, uh, it's covered. It looks like it's uh, wearing a helmet. With like maybe a dog or lion? Uh, I, I'd say lion or bear. Lion. Yeah, and he looks like he has a crown on top. Sort of, yes. Yeah, okay. I can pick it up. I just picked it up. Did that do anything on your end? Uh, no. Okay, I think what I need to do is I need to match the head. So what is the head that is above the stained glass? All right, it's a uh, guy with a full and long beard and huh? mustache with a sort of lion-like helmet as well in armor facing uh -huh. right. Right, okay, that looks like that's this one. Oh. Oh, I can pick that part up too? Hmm? Hmm. I can pick up the whole thing. Alright. Okay, so I'm gonna put... Where... Okay, let me say it this way. 
where is that on the left? Uh, um, what part of the uh, room is that? Image? It, it is like, the rightmost uh, uh, stained glass window for me. Okay, that really helps. Oh, geez. Okay, the stained glass to me is three parts, so I guess it's more involved than I initially thought. All but... right, there's uh, there's trees at the bottom. Dead oh, looking trees. This is a pain in the ass. <laughs> how do I how do I drop it? Escape. Um, I don't think I can actually put the windows back in where they go, so I must have to put them somewhere else. All right, is there any place where they can fit? Well, I guess I'll find out. Uh, by the Should way, it's uh, it's been twenty minutes. Okay. Uh, we'll go ahead and put a cut here then. Um. So, in any case, I hope you guys have enjoyed. This is Mouse Gunner and Leo, signing out.